K-I-L-R Taylor Games Gamers and Minecrafters, builders and explorers, I am the Killer Gamer, and welcome back to Minecraft Survival Showcase featuring Greenfield. This is where we check out a map that was created by someone or some ones uh, in the community, and we check out like every aspect that we possibly can. Um, of that map to fully appreciate uh, all the work that was done in uh, that was done uh, in, in that actual map to see what all the creators have done and we do that in survival mode because it is a way that we can fully immerse ourselves into that map not just flying around in creative mode um, but actually living in it I guess you could say um, but the focus is more on the exploration, not so much the survival part, but for fun, you know, we have it in survival mode and, or, you know, with the monsters and stuff like that, just to give it a little bit of a, a, a spice. <laughs> but yeah, that is what the Minecraft showcase, survival showcase is all about. And we're going to go ahead and talk about uh, where it is that we're at and what we're going to be doing here over the next few episodes. Okay, so this 2D map here uh, is of the whole <clears throat> Greenfield uh, map. At least the version that I'm playing. I believe there has been updates uh, since I've been, uh, since I've started. But we're sticking with the version uh, that I downloaded. And then we'll go back through and we'll take a look at any updates um, after we get done, you know, like 20 years from now or something. But <laughs> um, and I have had some questions on where in the world can you find this map? It is in the download of the Greenfield map itself. So all of that is in the description. So if you want to download and play this map. Um, everything uh, that you need, all, all, all the information is in the description of the video. So it's it's on Planet Minecraft. So that and the texture pack that we use, uh, that was meant to be used with the city, is right there in the description. So you can check that out. But yeah, so where are we? We have uh, we're here in Glenview. Where have we been? We started up here in the corner of Springfield and went to Melrose. Uh, over here to Clinton, Ashfield West. We were in Ashfield Central, what seemed to be like forever. And then we went to uh, the other half of Glenview. We did this half. And then we started coming back up through here. And we left off right here in this house. So what are we going to be doing over the next few episodes? Well, we're going to be traveling down... We're going to take a look and see what's behind this, these houses because there's all these little dots and I'm like wondering what in the world is all this stuff. So we're going to check that out, find out what that is. And then we're going to be going down these roads, checking out each of these houses, seeing what in the world that is. Um, and pretty much snaking our way up here to the very top of uh, Greenfield. And then there is this little building here. I uh, believe it was a McDonald's, if I'm not mistaken. And then this was that a uh, that Super A Mart. But yeah, but we'll be working our way over here, and we'll just double check what's over in this area here. Um, but other than that, we'll be done with Glenview. So that's what we're going to be working on over the next few episodes. Uh, and then after that. Whew, 
so exciting. We actually get to go into uh, Sunnyside and Ashfield East and we get to see what what's going on in these areas. You know, and then from there, we'll be... Uh, I know that there are people out there who are just waiting for me to hit the downtown area of Greenfield, and we will certainly do that. I'm thinking this has got to be the place that we got to hit after we, you know, view uh, Ashfield East, because we'll have this whole northern part done. So I think, I think downtown has got to be the next place that we do after that. And then we'll work our way across, and we'll work on our on, on this side, and then come down here. And who knows? We'll probably we may change it again, but that is at least what we got planned. Um, several several episodes from now, but let's focus on getting Glenview done, and then we'll work on Sunnyside and Asheville East, and then we can get excited for downtown. Woo! And I always like to show this uh, kind of 3D isometric uh, map, if you will, kind of like uh, <laughs> like The Sims, like The Sims 1, where you can like view it in four different directions. Because this is built, uh, th this comes from data directly from the actual game itself. It's using Map Crafter. So it's a great little way to actually get a more of a well, not a really 3D look, but I think you know what I mean. So we left off uh, right here. We're in this house here. So as I was saying, we're going to check out this alley behind here. We'll be snaking our way uh, up and down these roads here. Finding out what in the world we got here. Um, the McDonald's and we'll work our way and I don't know if we saw these or not but we'll check all this stuff out and and that's it because after that is uh, Sunnyside and uh, Ashfield East <laughs> so big exciting stuff let's waste no more time and let's get right into Greenfield so for those of you who are watching at a later date I am, uh, uh oh, I just heard a, I just heard a villager turn into a zombie. Uh, anyhow, <laughs> uh, this is being streamed on Twitch and one of our viewers from the killer community is here with us, Mr. Paul Henderson. Woo! Paul, yes, we're going to give you a shout out. Now he may be wondering, when is this going to show up on, on, on Killer Television? Well, you get to see this weeks before anyone else does. How about that? See, that's the great thing about following me on Twitch, is you get to see this stuff as I record them and stream at the same time. So you get to see this stuff early, unedited, and all that fun stuff. Can we sleep? Nope, we can't sleep. There are monsters nearby. And it's dark. <laughs> I'm afraid to find out what in the world is out here. Something tells me. Well, we'll eventually get out of here. <laughs> yeah, we stayed. We 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 stopped off in this this house. I hear something thumping over there. Oh, that's the Iron Golem. Here he is. No, we're good with the Iron Golem being there.
Oh, spider. There you are. Yeah, so this is more of an exploration series. It's not let it's not the let's kill all the monsters series. But we've got it in survival mode, so that way, you know, it has a little bit of spice to our exploration. Yeah. Come here. Yeah. Crap! Stupid. Yeah. <laughs> Dang skeleton. Sun should be coming up here soon. Yeah, just what we need is one of those creepers around here. Oh, I'm sure they'll show up. They never... They never fail to make their appearance. Appearance. Appearance! That's it. <laughs> Appearance! Sounds like Imperion! Galactic Survival! Yes, that is a, another series that we will be getting back to. It is currently in Alpha Experiment uh, is it 13 or something. It's in the Experimental Phase 13. I'm waiting for the Alpha, the, uh, the official Alpha release of 13 before I do uh, any videos slash streams with it. But as soon as it gets out of Experimental... Which, who knows, by the time you're seeing this on YouTube, it uh, it might already be out. But <laughs> but I will be doing those on Sunday for Sci-Fi... Uh, what is it? Sci-Fi Fantasy Sunday. Just haven't had anything recently. Well, I've had No Man's Sky, but... Ah! Yeah, I just haven't gotten back to that but yeah no man's sky and imperion galactic survival are two uh that will be streaming on sundays sun is back up all right i believe we came all the way down and i think we already saw all this up here I'm not mistaken. Yeah, because I put those blocks in front of the door so remind me I already went down that way. Yep, Paul, they were definitely guests outside. Well, I don't know if they were really guests. I didn't invite them. <laughs> Let's find out what those dots are that we saw on the map. Apparently, we're not supposed to go back here. Well, we're not going to let that stop us. Okay, so not really an alleyway. This is more of a, a walkway. Uh, I guess they have... I don't know. Is there anything in there? Ooh, maybe we don't want to know. <laughs> Okay, so that's what's back here. That's all the little dots that we were seeing. Uh, just like little boxes and crates and stuff. Nothing all that uh, overly exciting back here. So, we will continue our exploration right over here. We will check this house out and see what's... Okay, that made me a little nervous. <laughs> I forgot I have, like, all there's all these different little spooky sound effects that come up. Because it adds to the ambiance of everything. So what's in here? Probably nothing. <laughs> so we got a room in here. 
How many beds do I? Oh, I got plenty of those. I gotta be careful. Every time I go, hmm, I, I sound like a villager. And I don't want to do that. Where am I at? Oh, I went into the backyard. <laughs> oh, what the heck? Let's go back here where we were. And we'll go we'll go in through this uh this other door. Where is it? Right here? Yeah. Yeah, so here we are. We're in the little backyard of this other house right next door. That's a big TV! But is it 4K? Good question. I don't know. <laughs> So you uh, you like the cooking simulator? Yeah, that one's that one's relatively interesting. <laughs> I do have some more episodes I need to record for that one, um, so I will probably be doing some live streaming with Cooking Simulator on one of these Saturdays. Not sure when. There's a lot of flight simulator stuff coming up uh, that I am working on. Especially with the uh, the VATSIM. So since the uh, last episode that I recorded uh, with Minecraft, there's been... Uh, and and the, for those of you who don't already know, I do a lot of recording ahead of time. I do, I do big batches of recordings, and then I get to uh, split them up, set them up into separate episodes, yada, yada, yada. So that's why I say if you follow me on Twitch, you get to see stuff early, early before anyone else does. Um, but yeah, there's been maybe a few months uh, since this episode uh, and the one before it uh, were recorded. And in between that time, I've been uh, getting back to doing flying uh, with my flight simulators online with a uh i guess you could call it a service uh called that sim which is stands for virtual air traffic simulation i think is what it stands for and it's great fun and really adds to the immersion factor of uh flying your own your own plane so if you guys are into Flight Simulator, then I highly, highly recommend checking it out. What? Did we come through here? We came through here. I just, I don't remember this sitting here. <laughs> Had to have come this way. All right, you know what we're going to do? We, we got to leave our mark here to make sure that we know we were here. There, we were here. Check out this house here. Oh my, it's raining! Oh. Well, thanks, Paul. I, I'm. Makes me makes me feel good that you know I'm able to help brighten things up there for you. That's that's always my goal. If I, if I can brighten someone's day up, that means a lot to me. Lots of different designs and everything. So another great thing about this series, uh, just in case anyone is watching uh, in the middle of the series, is that um, 
there's a lot of great designs in here. So if you're looking for design ideas for building houses or apartments or stores or whatever, there's a lot that can be, uh, there's a lot you can learn uh, from, from this. Am I lost? <laughs> I'm like trapped. I don't know my way out. Okay, did I did I put the dirt over there? I think I did. All right, dirt, <laughs> dirt, dirt, dirt. Seven days to die. I have seven days to die. I, I bought it, oh my goodness, a few years ago. I played it a little bit, and I have not touched it since. My daughter uh, was really into the seven days to die because she's into the whole uh, zombie fandom and, and stuff. But she's not overly excited for the game anymore because they've, they've made changes to it that have that she really doesn't like. So, she's just kind of watching people play now. She's not really uh, sure if she wants to play or not. We have zombies in this game. I can't get in. Alright, so this is like a little... Oh, it's a little shower. <laughs> little shower there. Yeah, yeah, I thought about it. I've got so many games, so many things that, that I have that I haven't even, like, touched. <laughs> I bought more games than I have time. Oh, hey! Up here in the attic, apparently. Just checking to see if there's any stored goodies up here. Oh no, baby zombies, I hate those. Oh, and there you are. Hmm. Oh, he can't get through that. Come on over here. Alright, what do we have here that we don't need? We don't need string. Uh, we don't need an iron ingot either. <laughs> Laying out some bait. Whoa, jeez. <laughs> that was an Enderman. Not to be confused with Slenderman. Which I probably need to check that out too. 5432. Let's go in here. Ah! Not another one! Stop moving around! Ugh. What do you do? Sneak in behind me? Uh, I don't know. Is there a bed in here? Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, that's open. Well, let's just shut that. Hmm. 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 I don't know. I think I'm just going to place a bed down. How about that? We'll just set it right here. Miscreate it. What is miscreate? Is that another game? This is kind of pretty back here. I actually like this. This nice little kind of patio thing here. Well, that don't open up. We'll go back over here. Okay, these are supposed to be beds. <laughs> Not everything that you think is a bed. No, you can't sleep on it. It's just for looks. It's look. Don't touch. Alright, we've been there. Alright, so we got another... Another street here. Ah, another horror crafter survival game. Yeah, Imperion Galactic uh, Survival is a space-based uh, crafting uh, survival game. It's along the lines of No Man's Sky, uh, but in a different way. It has... Um, I'm not going to say a, a Minecraft uh, kind of feel to it. I mean, it's it's, but you can build things in it like you can with Minecraft. So you have you have building blocks and stuff, and you can build spaceships and hovercrafts and uh, bases, space stations, and all the while you're having to survive as well. Surviving the elements, making sure you've got food, make sure you've got power, make sure you can defend yourself against uh, uh, alien invaders. It's a pretty kick-butt game. Um, and then once you can get off the planet, uh, and, you know, then there is... It was limited to just the solar system, but now they're, they've got that expanded to where there's going to be... Uh, where it's like No Man's Sky. You've got, um... <laughs> you, you've got uh, tons of systems and stuff to explore, so... Yeah, it's going to be amazing. This is interesting. Oh, so I think that's supposed to be a fireplace right there. I don't have anything I can really light it up with. That's okay. That's okay. Oh, I hear two of those baby zombies over there. Not something I really want to... That's clever. So, you've got these that are blocking the light, so that way it, it's, it's illuminating. It's giving off light. But it's not, you're not seeing it. So that is kind of a, that's a clever idea. So it, it, it's a good way to have hidden lights. So they got it going there, up there too. I was beginning to wonder what in the world this, this was, and now I th it's just arrows. Okay, there's a bed there. Nah. Just for show. Sometimes we find, like, these little uh, hidden Easter eggs and stuff that creators have left. So it's just kind of cool just to kind of go through here and see if we manage to discover something that a uh, 
a creator left. Pretty cool house. All right. Alrighty, we'll go ahead and take a break right here. want to thank everyone for watching. I hope you're enjoying uh, what you're seeing. Uh, and if so, go ahead and click that like button. Uh, that like button, what that does, uh, that uh, helps me out in the video and the channel and the series because uh, it helps with that whole algorithm thing uh, with YouTube. So the more people that like a video and uh, leave comments on it, uh, the more likely it's it's going to be seen by uh, other people out there that may also be trying to find a series like this for whatever reason. Maybe they're they're looking for ideas for their own builds, or maybe they just want to sit back and and relax and and just you know and enjoy uh, some you know friend family friendly uh, content because uh, sometimes it's kind of hard to find that on YouTube. You never know what you're going to get. Uh, when you pull up a video, you know, is it going to have, uh, you know, nasty language on it? Is it going to have something political in it that you don't, don't want to watch? You know, you never really know. Um, but we try to keep all of that out uh, uh, when it comes to this channel. Because uh, <laughs> that just gets to be uh, a little bit of a sticky situation. And that's not what we want want to do here. We want to keep things uh, friendly. We want to keep things friendly uh, and fun uh, for everyone. But uh, yeah, so go ahead and, and, and leave a like uh, because you're, you guys are all, you're all helping each other out. You know, you're you're helping each other out on the things that that you enjoy, enjoy watching and stuff. That's what our killer community is all about. It's about banding together. And speaking of banding together, clicking on that subscribe button, that makes you part of the killer community. So instead of just being an observer <laughs> or tourist, tourists are fine. But if you want to take that extra step and actually become a member of the killer community, then clicking that subscribe button will certainly do that. That way you'll get notified of when there is Minecraft uh, content being uploaded to the channel or any type of content that I upload to the channel. And then if you like to have that live stream uh, uh, connection uh, with the person that you're watching, I do live stream over on Twitch. And so I've been live streaming uh, this particular episode and one of our uh, viewers uh, in the killer community, Paul Henderson, uh, was hanging out with me. And you can also be just like Paul. Just head on over to Twitch, twitch.tv slash killergamer. And you can follow me there. And you can also be part of the show. How about that? How cool is that? How many shows are out there where you can be a part of it? I mean, when it comes to the stuff that's out in Hollywood and stuff like that, it's more about them than it is us. You know what I mean? You know, inter inter entertainment should be... I don't know. I mean, I don't really get too much into stuff that Hollywood does anymore. It, it, there seems to be too much garbage surrounding it. But the fact that you can go out... Uh, and, and, and sit back and, and, and watch one of your favorite uh, uh, YouTubers or, or streamers um, that is just making content from the heart, you know, instead of money. Because uh, I, I don't make money off of this stuff. Um, I, I wish. <laughs> Maybe someday. Uh, so I do all this stuff out of the heart. And... And as a result, you also uh, get to interact with me uh, over on Twitch. You, you, um, so it's it's more than just watching stuff. You get to chat with me too, and you get to be on on board the adventure as we're doing it. And you get to see this stuff uh, weeks and months ahead of time. So, like Paul, he saw all this stuff 
uh, weeks ahead <laughs> before it was turned into an episode. And then there is uh, social media. So there's uh, Instagram and Twitter and Snapchat. Instagram I use for all the behind the scenes uh, stuff uh, that I work on. Um, so if you kind of like want to see what it is that I'm working on, head over to Instagram and check out the photos and pictures and stuff that I take. Sometimes I take a few videos as well. And then Twitter I use for uh, retweets and official announcements. I'll share a few pictures there uh, and stuff there. Also let you know when I'm going on uh, live. On, try to give you guys a little bit of a, a heads up on uh, official things. And then Snapchat, yeah, it's just, just there, just for fun. And then for the whole serious part, if you want to take a step further and not just be part of the killer community, but actually become a citizen of the, uh, the killer empire, or perhaps an officer of the killer empire, or well, what do I mean by that? No, I'm talking about donating. Uh, donating and helping support your favorite creator. If you'd like to do that uh, for killer television, I have Patreon set up, all kinds of tier levels set up there. Uh, all the way from just like one dollar a month to several hundred <laughs> I definitely don't expect that uh, I don't expect any donation but uh, take a look at that I have different reward levels and stuff set up so whatever interests you check it out other than that it's getting uh, darker so we probably should go find some cover or something but anyways thanks so much for watching I appreciate it I will see you on the next episode of our adventure. Stay safe, stay healthy, and have a killer awesome day.